Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Planned Parenthood in hot water. Now we know what they did during the election. A political arm of Planned Parenthood is in trouble for what they hid during the election. It raises other questions about this nefarious organization. Everyone needs to know about this. Millions of Americans detest Planned Parenthood. Yet the group still thrives like a cancer in our society. This organization specializes in the deaths of unborn children. They claim to provide health care to low-income women. That's true if you define health care as millions of abortions. The act of abortion is considered an outdated and barbaric practice by many in the United States. Somehow, though, Planned Parenthood continues their work. Perhaps it's because Congress refuses to defund the evil organization. Every year, they get huge checks from the government, checks that further the destruction of human life. We know why, of course. Planned Parenthood conducts a mafia-like scheme between themselves and the Democrats. They funnel millions of dollars into candidates' campaigns. Once elected, these liberals happily funnel hundreds of millions of taxpayer dollars into Planned Parenthood's coffers. They keep this scheme going year after year, draining money from the American people, all to keep both parties happy and well-funded. It looks like one Planned Parenthood group took a misstep, though. During the 2016 elections, the Wisconsin branch dumped over $100,000 into liberal campaigns. The only problem? They didn't disclose it to the FEC. Oops. Planned Parenthood's political arm in Wisconsin has been fined for failing to appropriately report nearly $120,000 in independent expenditures allocated in support of Democratic candidates Hillary Clinton and Russ Feingold during 2016 elections. The Federal Election Commission FEC, found discrepancies in Planned Parenthood advocates of Wisconsin's October 2016 report that claimed over $133,000 worth of expenditures on political candidates, and FEC report said. Nearly $120,000 spent in August on Clinton and Democrat Feingold, who tried but failed to unseat Republican Senator Ron Johnson in 2016, were never shown in any previous 48-hour filing up until the October report, two months later when it was required. The Planned Parenthood group reportedly spent $58,449.04 in support for Clinton and as much in support of Feingold. Source, Fox News. Why didn't the Wisconsin PP disclose this amount? We know, nationwide, Planned Parenthood shelled out millions to help Hillary Clinton. They used the millions of dollars they got from the government. That's your tax dollars being spent to get a crook elected. We shouldn't be too surprised who they were spending the money on. Hillary Clinton and her cronies love Planned Parenthood. They are proud of a woman's right to choose, that choice being to abort their unborn child. Clinton would have promised to protect Planned Parenthood had she been elected. In fact, she would probably have increased the amount of cash they get every year. Other Democrats are known for their open support of the group. Democrats proudly declare they defend a woman's right to kill their unborn child. Imagine being that disturbed, that you're proud of killing your child, but that is the DNC today. The office is claiming it was all a misunderstanding. Their staff, which should have been trained, didn't notify all the contributions earlier. Sure. Or maybe this group is used to keeping things from the government and the American people, like the fact that it routinely sells aborted baby parts to labs even though it's against the law. Or the fact that they claim to provide comprehensive health care to women in need. But when women go to Planned Parenthood for help, they are only offered abortions. Even basic procedures are only offered, if in the pursuit of getting an abortion. The real crime is that this massive group is getting slapped on the wrist for this mistake. The group will have to pay a $5,850 fine for the wrongdoing, the Washington Free Beacon reported. Really? That's nothing for a group that gets hundreds of millions of dollars from the government. This group should be under investigation for its horrendous practices and deceptive tactics. It should be defunded and kicked to the curb. Instead, it gets millions of dollars from the government and is hardly held accountable when they break the law. The only way Planned Parenthood would be brought to justice is if we elected people who refuse to support it. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.